motivation, inspiration. It's all bullshit without taking action. International best-selling author, serial entrepreneur, tough love, no BS, high-performance coach with an attitude. Welcome to the Queendom, where we talk about proven strategies to scale your business and scale your mind for ultimate success. And here's your hostess, cash flow queen, Kenitra. Greetings and peace, family. All right, so we are here with another episode. And today being Monday, is our Meditation Monday. And we're going to be talking about sun gazing. Now, before we get started, um, let's go ahead and get into the present moment. So we'll just uh, take a couple of breaths and get ourselves uh, present in this moment, in this space, and in this time. So we'll take a couple of deep breaths and get present. All right, so I hope that your weekend was fantastic. I hope your week uh, is starting off on a positive note and things are going great for you. So today, uh, again, it's Meditation Monday. We're going to be talking about sun gazing. Sun gazing is um, a fantastic meditation. It's, um, number one, very beneficial to be out in the sun. Um, The sun provides all of the nourishment and life for Earth as well as for you. Without the sun, there would be no Earth there will be no us. Um, And with that being said, you know, many ancient cultures, especially uh, ancient Kemet, as we know as modern day Egypt, um, actually worshiped, you know, they did like sun worship rituals and really believed in the healing power of uh, the sun and, and the solar energy. People today, you know, they still consider like the sun to be a powerful life-giving celestial body. So a um, couple of things that I'll share with you from my own experiences uh, with sun gazing meditation is um, I will typically um, do my sun gazing at sunrise and at sunset. These are the times when it's said by science that it's actually safe for you to look directly into the sun. Um, Times outside of that, you could, you know, mess up your eyes and things like that. So it's at sunrise and at sunset that I've had the most um, benefits. And for me, I just simply sit and I think about whatever intention it is that I'm wanting to create and I will focus my intention on the fulfillment of that creation or the manifestation of that creation. So I'll, I'll usually sit like in an Indian style. Um, if, I'm, if I'm like on a surface like a grass or say like a mountain or something like that, then I will do it barefoot. That way that I can, you know, soak up the um, earth ions and you know all of the good things that you know naturally come from the earth while I'm sun gazing so I'm actually doing two different things at one time so again I'll sit like an Indian style I will focus on the intention focus on the completion or the manifestation of what whatever it is that I'm wanting to achieve whatever my intention is and I simply um, will gaze, you know, gaze sometimes. uh, And and depending on if you're experienced with this or not, um, even at sunrise and sunset, you may not be able to look directly. So I think that's why it's called gazing, because you just kind of gaze at it and allow the the sun to meet, you know, your, your eyes. And you're just simply doing deep breathing. 
So you're deep breathing. You're thinking about your intention. You're thinking about the fulfillment, the manifestation, the completion of what it is that you want to create. And you're breathing deeply. And during that time, you're also being very grateful and you're being very thankful for the completion as if it's already done. See, that's the, the real key to any meditation is to act as if it's already done. So you want to be in a space where, you know, you feel the gratitude in advance. Like you're not, you're not waiting for the thing to happen because if it's already happened in your mind, that's another reality. So it has already happened. It's, it's done. Ashe, as we say. So it is. So it's already done. Okay. So have that gratitude in advance, you know, not waiting for the three dimensional plane to, to uh, show it to you. You've already on the fourth dimension in your mind in the astral plane, you've already completed it. So you should be thankful in advance. Trust me on this formula. It, it absolutely works. Okay. Um, some other benefits to sun gazing, it regulates hormones. It balances your circadian rhythm. It also uh, improves your sleep quality. Obviously, we know like it increases, um, you know, vitamin D because when the when the sun, you know, connects with your body, then your body produces the vitamin D. The vitamin D is already inside of your body. You just need the sun to actually power it up, if you will. Um, it can also improve your your eyesight your eyesight as well as uh, your mental health and it compacts uh, or combats fatigue and drowsiness. So those are some some really, um, you know, key benefits outside of whatever it is that you are wanting to manifest and create. Those are some additional side benefits that sun gazing can help you with as well. Some also believe like on a, on a spiritual level, like, um, there are benefits to sun gazing, like connecting with the higher power or your higher spiritual self, um, recharging, increasing your energy, improving your mood, and just attracting positive energy. You know, if you look at the sun, the sun is nothing more than, um, you can call it like a nuclear power center. It powers everything in our existence. It gives not only the earth life, but it gives us life as well. So um, that is sun gazing, you know, um, something that you can incorporate into your other meditative practices that you're doing. And uh, I always say, you know, with meditation, find the ones that really resonate with you and that really help you and that you like, and then you will continue to do those particular practices and get better at it and better at it and better at it. All right. So I hope you've enjoyed today's episode with sun gazing and we will hear you talk with you on tomorrow. So peace and unconditional love to you. Thank you for tuning in. Please like, share, and subscribe via iTunes and Google Play for upcoming episodes. If you're committed to scaling your business and life to the next level, book a free strategy session with Cashflow Queen Kenitra by visiting the website, nobscloser.com. Again, that's N-O-B-S-C-L-O-S-E-R.com. Again, visit nobscloser.com to book a free strategy session today.